Step in the box, sports cards fans. Welcome back to another episode. Have a little mail day from Tops. This is my Montgomery Club membership. I uh, renewed, and I believe it was November. $199 bucks plus tax. You get five items sent to you during the year, plus exclusives that you get open. For example, if you've been, if you've stayed tuned, um, I opened that uh, soccer product a few weeks ago, a week ago, whatever long it was, it was, and then uh, have some Bowman Sapphire coming that I was able to get. So this club is amazing. It is really hard to get into it now. I'm glad I got into it a couple years ago. But here we go. Let's get a, I'll share what I got so you can kind of see what you get with the club. This is the first set of the year. I'm going to get that out of the way. And here we go. So here's how it's packaged. I reuse these bubble envelopes all the time for shipping. I love these things. They just reseal back up. So save that. And here's the 582 Montgomery Club. Started in 18. I missed it in 18. So I, I wasn't sure if it was 17 or 18. So started in 18. I got into it last year. Glad I did. Recommendation from a friend. And here we go. Let's see. There should be, uh, I believe, a 25-card set. And I believe there's going to be an auto in this one. Two of the products have autos in them. There's a sticker set. But let's see here. Bellinger on the front. Looks like we got Mike Trout, so it must be a 20 card set then. Last year I thought it was 25. But I, each year there's an exclusive set. I have no idea how many of these memberships they sell. Uh, the best thing that you get is the complete set. If you go back, not too long ago at the end of the year, got my uh, 2020 complete set with the Montgomery Club stamp. That usually pays for your membership. Those sell for about 200 bucks. I opened it, but if you really want your money back, it's whew, almost dumped those. Let's see if this one has an autograph or not. All right, let's uh, go from here. And I sleeve all these. I'm going to grab a few extra sleeves. There we go. And Cody Bellinger is the first one. And we have a Clevenger on the back. As our auto. So a pitcher auto. Clevenger comes popping out of there. There we go. Last year I got a Garrett Cole as my first autograph. And I was like, perfect. It was a Yankees uniform. I reuse these two. Clevenger. So, I mean, I don't know. Clevenger's a pitcher. He's in the league. Freddie Freeman. What do you guys think of this design? Kyle Lewis, rookie. Centering looks, I tell you what, there's been times where I've gotten these products from Tops and the centering is just butchered. I don't know, the centering might even be off a little bit there. Kyle Lewis, rookie. I'm assuming there's going to be a Lubob in here. The Lubob should look pretty sharp. Glaber Day. Ryu. We got, wow, I'm surprised he's in here. Mike Brasso. Brasso. Second rookie. We got Verdugo. They're mixing up this first set. Usually it's just like Hall of Famers and studs. Last year it was like Griffey. There's Kess and Luke Voigt, so not as star-powered in this first one as I would like, but what can you say? We know we have a Trout, Luke Voigt, Matt Chapman, 
still, I mean, major league players, unique cards. There's a Juan Soto. There's a first star power. So Juan Soto. Those are pretty cool. Make sure the backs are, yeah, usually the backs are all the same. We got a Dominic Smith. That's a weird one. Not sure why they'd put that one in there. And we got a Grisham rookie. There we go. Ooh, we got one that's going to my PC. I'll get a top loader and get ready to put that in the pile. There is the Nico Horner. That'll go in the PC. I'll put them on Rookie Pal for now. We have a Clevenger for the Padres base. Pulled his auto right behind that was Luis Arise. So, man, I'm kind of disappointed with this first set. I'm not going to lie. The names in here are not very good. But... It is what it is. They got an Aquino in here. Here's an Acuna. Sorry, I need to get this sleeve open. So Tops is coming out of the gate with probably the least of the products so far that I've seen from Montgomery Club compared to last year. I've seen them all from the year before, too. Acuna. We know we have a Trout. And Austin Nola, so they had some of the big rookies in before, but Acuna's good. Austin Nola. And if they didn't have Mike Trout, it would be highly disappointing. But we have Mike Trout. Come on, get open sleeve. So that is this set. Not the best. I tell you what, it's not the best set that we've seen. Let's go through what I consider just kind of non-star base. Like the one set out to start off the year had Griffey and a bunch of Hall of Famers. Arise, Clevenger, Smith, Chapman, Voigt, Herrera, Verdugo, Ryu, Glaber Day. Eh, we could put Glaber Day over there, and we could probably put Bellinger here. And Freddie Freeman's a stud. Just not, not as big as, you know, you'd rather have Griffey than some of these, but here we go. Again, recapping here, Freeman, there's the Bellinger, Glaber, we saw those, the Mike Trout, the Acuna, and the Soto. Got some big boys there. And then we got the Clevenger Auto. Sticker Auto. Here we go. And then uh, let's look at the rookies. See who the best rookie is. Austin Nola. Kyle Lewis. Aquino. Obviously, the Nico's going on the PC. Trent Grisham. And Mike Rousseau. So, the two big rookies right here. Kyle Lewis, Trent Grisham. What would you guys think of this Montgomery Club set? First one of the year. Looks like a 20 card set, one auto. I like the designs of these cards, they're okay. I wish I had some of my other cards close um, to compare from last year, but they're stored away. But I, I, it's cool, I mean, this is not why you get in the Montgomery Club anyway. There's other products, but plain and simple, to be able to buy the exclusives is clutch. So, I've already scored this year. Already this year. I missed the Garbage Pail, pail Kids. Didn't even know about it. But uh, purchased the two boxes of soccer, two boxes of Chrome Sapphire already. And it's, we're just kicking off. That's We're just kicking off the year now. So, thanks again for tuning in. Have a great weekend, everybody. Peace.